The issue with vision is you generally don't take much time to set up a vision system. So if you know vision, that's good, but you're only going to be working on it for probably like a week or so out of a project and then you're going to be on to the next thing. Whereas like HMI development is probably going to take uh, the next least amount of time. Maybe you'll have a couple weeks into that depending on the complexity of the HMI. Um, and then probably next will be robot and next will be PLC, but that also kind of depends on, on your programming structure. Some companies like to program majority of everything in the PLC and then they just send the logic to the robot to basically command it what moves to make. Um, I prefer the robot have a lot more control and, and have a lot of the robot's functionality in the robot, but th that's kind of a preference thing and kind of how different companies structure the way they go about doing their programming. Structured text is also a really good one to learn. You're not going to do a ton of structured text in industrial automation, but if you're good at structured text and you're good at process control, that is kind of lethal because structured text is way more powerful than like PLC programming, robot programming. It adds a lot more flexibility and you can do a lot more things with it. So if you have the understanding of structured text, then the PLC and the robot programming, stuff like that, will be much easier because you already understand those complex structures and jumping around in programs and things along those lines. Uh